and I'm pleased to make this statement on the International Day for the Elimination of Violence Against Women. Lindy Kimi Lucina, Dana Isaac, Maria Williams, Wendy Sleeman, Rebecca Kluwer, a 37-year-old unnamed woman in the Northern Territory, Anastasia Slasher, Crystal Monks, Tricia Lamborn, Janet Guthrie, Margaret Mars Smetherham, Jacqueline Jackie Lee Purton, <coughs> Hannah Pringle, Lisa Fennick, Erin Malavy, Elaine Naroldal, Emmerich Lasaka, Kerry Bodney, Lynn Wright, Heather Ball, Tatiana Tanya Dohatara, Monique Lazak, a 34 year old unnamed woman in Western Australia, Maria Ivanovic, Christy Armstrong, Amira Muni, Kumanji Skeen, Christine Formosa Rakic, a 47 year old unnamed woman from the Northern Territory, an unnamed woman in her 30s from Western Australia, Alexandra Vogulis, Gypsy Satterley, Jessica Townley, Linda Kerr, Georgia Lyle, Joan Hobbs, Jean Morley, a 40-year-old unnamed woman from Victoria, Tiffany Woodley, Marie Vermont, 11-week-old Murphy Margaret Cox and her mother Taylor, Drew Douglas, Lise Muliaga, an 87-year-old unnamed woman from Victoria, Catherine Safranco, Rebecca Collard, Heather Dean, Yu Grace Zhu, Crystal Marshall, Ti Tui Huong Nguyen, Lily James, Logie Osasis, Alice Rose McSherra, Deirdre D. Folp, a 44-year-old unnamed woman from South Australia, a 45-year-old unnamed woman from South Australia, Julianne Egan, a 39-year-old unnamed woman from South Australia, Jodie Jewell, Katchuzi Makato. Speaker, I've been reading out names for over two minutes, and I have done this because I want the names of these women to be etched into our national record. I want these names to echo across this place and to be broadcast across our nation, because these are the names of women killed in Australia this year. In listing these names, I want us to recognise among this list and along with this list are the forgotten women. These forgotten women have disappeared. They've been taken away from us. These are the women yet to be found. These are the countless forgotten women dumped in bins, buried in bushland, hidden from view, their hopes and dreams snatched away. This is uncomfortable for us to face, but we have to reckon with this issue. We have to drag it out of the shadows and we have to confront it. Because what I can say without any hesitation is that too many women have been killed already this year. What I can say is this is a national crisis and not enough is being done about it.